puppet zone. Well, it's flicky, so I guess that um, Gene Gadget isn't the last one if you don't have all the Chaos Emeralds. Must just be my imagination. Oh, and yay, we have switches. I'll get into that in a second. Um, switches should be obvious what they do if you jump on them properly. They will make this go a different way. It's pretty much all it is, but sometimes they're awkward to get on. That's the only real problem I have with them. <laughs> the only real problem I have with them, sometimes they are awkward. That's this entire game in a nutshell. Sometimes it is awkward. Okay, the way you're meant to do this is by floating here until it comes over and then getting on it, I think. Um, but generally I don't bother, I just jump. And I'm breaking my rule about not collecting ring boxes if I don't get it on the first turn. And yes, this, get, this level is different. It might only be this app. It's different because there's no bad mix. The flickies are all encased in little tubes. Um, okay, gonna stop jumping while standing on a slope because then you just get thrown backwards. Like what I just did then. And again, yay for the genius in me. I'm trying to rush. That's probably my biggest problem. I'm doing it again. Okay, stop it. Alright, one, two, okay, missed that one. Three, and up, right. Blue one in here. Ah, and I stupidly walked into it. Yeah, so there's no flick, there are bad nicks. There are. There's just no flickies in them. And that took me to another area. I was half expecting it to take me back to the beginning, which I think it did. I just didn't get that flicky earlier. So I suppose it was fortunate. So yeah, going through again. One flicky left to find. All flickies left to pick up. Right, I've just got to time it right. If I can land on that, I can get up the rest of the way. speed. I hate that. Okay, I've already got that one. Right. The last one would be over this way. Is it protected by that? Yes, it is. That's all the flickies. Lots and lots of danger. Good for the soul. Five, that's good. Oh, brilliant. All I had to do was go through this way earlier. Not been very lucky with that randomly guessing which way to go, have I? Okay, I'm currently invincible. Now, that's going the wrong way, so I have to switch it like that. Like that. Then go on it. Obviously, can't move on conveyor belts either. You just gotta wait until they drop you off. Like this. Oh yay, my friends, the electrical. Ah. 
the electrical, that made no sense. Oh, uh, whoa, whoa. Okay, okay, okay. Right, that switch back there, that was only if you'd missed a flicky. You'd have to go back and get it. I'm guessing, you know, you could take the conveyor belt back. That'd be the only way back. You'd have to switch it back so you could go back. Act 2. Right, this is the act I was thinking of earlier. But you'll notice there is no flicky meter at the bottom. That's because there are no flickies in this level. We have collected the final flicky in the game. And I didn't make a big deal about it. Anyway, no, pretty much this one, if you can believe it, is um, all about going round and round in circles. No, no, it's not really. It's about trying to get into that massive thing we saw there, which recognize it is Robotnik. Ah! Lots of explosions and death. And electricity and more explosions. And me jumping a lot. may be wondering, oh, how do we get to that extra life that was up there? Why are you bothering with these rings? I don't know. The extra life, uh, that looks different. Um, so, if I remember rightly, and stopped walking, you can break through it, and then that takes you up to the life. And I'm trying to run away from him. Is this the right one? probably going to take me up to the top in there. Oh no! It isn't. Where is it taking me? Here. Right. Run and jump. That's generally how you get through levels like this. Standing on the platform will make it raise. Now this one, generally, you have to be a bit more patient. Sure there's a way to get across it easily, but I don't want to risk it. Because that will happen. Wonderful, huh? Like I said, depth of perception, not good. I should probably look at the shadow and not at the actual platform. It's wonderful when you just run into things. Shield. That should protect me for only two seconds. I got that in there before I lost it, just because I knew I would. <sighs> Falling platforms are evil. Right, the end of this act, you go up Robotnik's nose. Always thought that was a bit disgusting. 